Hi again, Doug here from X Frames FPV, and today we're just going to do a quick little update on how the Neato 220 Dallas is going. And you know, like I said, I'm building this for a customer here that's fairly local, and um, he wanted the red, yellow, and green color scheme. So we've got some paracord here that we're running. Um, going to be running out to the arms when it's all said and done and built everything will be kind of tucked in really nice and cleanly and these will be run nice and tight so it's going to look really good um, but I just wanted to kind of just do a quick overview of, of what we're doing here so let's let's zoom in here even closer here make sure that everything's in shot yep so this is how in the back here I have plenty of room in between the standoffs to run these really small XS or ES25 ESCs for the size for a 25 amp. These are really nice and small, about the same size as a BL Heli 20 amp. So it's great. Um, got it wired up for the 5 volts and then have some of the, got the, the, this is going to be the, this has the arrow camera, so it has OSD. So this is the wire to get voltage um, for the OSD system. As far as the ESCs in the front, I'm going to bring them back a little bit and kind of, I've kind of built up the middle there with some um, thicker foam neoprene. And there wasn't quite enough room to, to put these flat. But yet, you know, there's enough room where I can almost get them flat. So I, rather than stack them on top of each other, I decided I'm going to mount them this way. And the wires will come in and be mounted onto them. So, you know, it's uh, going really well. This is, you know, these builds take a little more time because of, um, you know, this has got a lot of little components. We've got the wires ran for the LED here. Um, already do have the... Um, flight controller wired up and ready to, to drop in. And I have the VTX mounted. Um, but they do take a little more time because, you know, you've got to make sure that everything is nice and clean. When when everything is said and done, this this is going to be a really pretty build. And so you, you take a little bit more um, time to get everything ran really nicely. So... Just wanted to give an update on what's going on with this. And you guys, check out my website, xframesfpv.com. And thanks so much for your subscriptions, like, and comment. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. And um, hope you get a little time today to fly.